Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, Kimmy. Welcome to my new channel, Beauty by Kimmy. Today I will be reviewing, also doing a tutorial on just a basic look for the daytime spring look um, with this new eyeshadow by Almay. And I've been dying to try it out because look how pretty that is, guys. So pretty. Uh, very nice orange. I also have a lipstick to match. I really want to do something just kind of matchy. Or, I don't know. And maybe a little bit more um, daring on the eyes. Just a little bit, you know what I'm saying, with the crease areas. I'm going to probably do a whole lid with this color. And I also will be using my Soft Focus Black Radiance Powder. This is perfect finishing powder. So I'm going to def definitely use that. Um, and I also have, um, I already used this. I did a product review on Elf's Mineral Face Primer, guys. This is really, really good. I actually have it on now. Um, so I've already prepped my face for that. And what I'm going to go ahead and do is get started. So the first thing I am going to do is just put some more powder on because I really am loving this face powder. Um, Black Radiance has really nice products, guys. I love the compact of this Soft Focus Powder Compact. Um, look at that. Look how fancy it is. I don't know. It doesn't cost a whole bunch, but it just makes you feel like you're doing something because um, the way the products are put in these little nice packaging. Even with Elf, Elf's products, I really like those as well. And... The cost is pretty reasonable. You can you can get a pretty good look um, with your makeup if you know what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? Just different techniques and you can kind of cheat your way through. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to spend a whole lot of money. That's what I'm trying to say, guys. Right now, I am using the Soft Focus Finishing Powder. And, guys, the color is Almond Finish and... It looks really, really nice and natural. Now, the past few days, I've been wanting something just a little bit light on my skin, so that's why I have not been adding the liquid foundation like I was doing. I was adding it in certain areas underneath here. But what I'm going to do is use my highlighter for that, and I will show you because I really haven't had to do that. Um, the highlighter I'm going to use... Let me get my little compact here it's this one right here um, a really nice little illuminating kit it's got a bronzer um, the, the highlighter right there and I really don't use this one at all but I may find a use for it later but right now I am going to hit up that little color right in the center and add it underneath my eye it just kind of brightens the eye area just a little bit I like that um, and then I'll go back over it with my powder if it seems a little bit too raccoony. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think I got a little bit happy, guys. A little too happy. I am loving the brushes. I bought a new uh, retractable brush. I love the fact that this brush is is so awesome. You can take it with you. Look how look how cool that look how cool that is. It has a top so you don't have to worry about your brushes getting dirty and you just let that down and there you go bam nice little bronzing brush perfect so definitely try out these uh, real technique brushes guys perfect I try to get a multiple um, I'm, well whenever I buy one brush I try to get at least two more brushes because you know sometimes it's a pain or to wash these brushes out it just kind of gets on your last nerve all right, and what I'm gonna do is take the bronzer right here, and I like to go up here at the top and just kind of dust my face a bit and the bridge of my nose. I don't do a contouring on my nose, but I do like to kind of accentuate a little bit with the bronzer and as well as my cheeks. I like to go there. And guys, I'm telling you, if you start um, doing this, you get, I mean, so many compliments throughout the day. It's just like, you look so healthy. You know what I'm saying? See, look at that. The contouring that I do is for my cheeks. Um, I definitely do, I do the contouring on that because I have put on a couple of extra pounds, which sometimes goes straight to my face. 
And the color that I am using for uh, the contouring is um, Deep. No, this one's Ebony. 8615 Black Radiance. And I am going to apply it. Bam. There. And it's, it's really natural, just more of a natural look, you know, nothing too harsh. Um, I thought about going a little bit deeper, so that's why I was thinking maybe get me deep next time um, for the evening. Or just a little bit more um, dramatic look, you know, for the evening time. So we'll see how that goes. I keep forgetting to pick some up. The next time I go out, I think I'll do that. But um, yeah, this looks really, really nice. Um, very very soft focus like it says and I am going to try out the new all day well it's new for me it's not necessarily new but um, I am loving um, orange lately and I figure I will try out some orange eyeshadow okay I'm trying to get this open guys right now and just like having a hard time with these nails. Can I get it open? Yeah, this is not going to work. I have, I don't have any scissors on it. There we go, all right, it's coming. It's coming, guys, it's coming. There we go, so it's just a little, cute little compact thing in here. And it opens just like so. And if you want to, you can go ahead and add a nice base color on your lids, to, you know, for the color to go on a lot better. All right, guys, this Almay product, um, it looks very pretty in the case. Um, I'm not having any luck with this. Um, I don't know, it fools you into thinking that it's going to be highly pigmented, but it's not, as you see. See how it's kind of, I don't know, it almost looks frosted. Um, I don't know what's that about, or maybe it's just my brush. Um, but I'm not impressed with this at all. <laughs> not at all. What is going on here? Let me try a swatch up here. Yeah, this is definitely not showing up on my skin. Maybe you're supposed to wet it? Yeah, it definitely sucks. It sucks! It totally, totally sucks! Alright, this is not working. Um, it does not look orange. For some reason, I just knew that this was going to be so pretty. But it's not working, guys. Definitely not working out. So I am going to finish doing the makeup. And I'm going to show you that the um, lip gloss that I bought, though. I think that is super pretty. This is the Hard Candy Fierce Effects uh, Darling Lip Gloss. Um, I really, I bought this um, thinking that it would complement the eyeshadow, but, you know, it's not working, guys. You don't need a lip pencil to uh, put on with this color, but it will probably help. But, it, you know, I've noticed that this uh, lip gloss lasts. As long as you're not eating um, anything, it lasts a couple of hours and you don't have to keep uh, reapplying it. And look how pretty that is. Beautiful. So, um, the eyeshadow by Elme is not working at all. But definitely the lip gloss, Fierce Effects lip gloss, the uh, face primer, and the soft focus um, powder looks great so if you definitely want to have a more of a natural look and a glow i would definitely try some of those bronzers um, just find one you like you know and right now i'm just applying a little bit more of the soft focus finishing powder just to kind of balance out that look a little bit Alright, that's what the eyeshadow looks like, guys. It does not look orange, um, but it's, it's pretty. 
but it does not look orange. So if you buy this color and you're thinking it's gonna look exactly like that, just think if your skin is a lot more fair, I think, you know, maybe you will have a better chance with the color, but my skin um, is just not picking up the color it, or, unless it just does not show up. Um, and right now I'm sitting in front of my bedroom window and I have natural uh, lighting, so it's definitely not showing up. But yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. And if you like to see um, some more tutorials, product reviews, um, anything related to fashion, beauty, cosmetics, and all that, just subscribe. And thank you for watching. And again, don't forget to stay beautiful.